So you were out on your mining session in 4D Miner. And you lost your house. You see, you did one mistake there. And that mistake was not, you know, putting blocks. But bro, this is the first dimension, fourth dimension. What are you even talking about? Normal Minecraft tactics don't work here. Well, I'm going to tell you they do. You just have to understand how this world works, just like you have to understand how Minecraft world works. I'll give you an example. In my, if you watched my last video, if you haven't, go watch it. I built this house, and I've stated this house is protected from all directions, from all W coordinates as well. And how do I know that? Is I simply looked. You see, in 40 Minecraft, you have a mechanic that you don't have in normal Minecraft, which is to look into the W axis, which is the fourth dimension. Now, what is the fourth dimension? Like I said, like I said last video, the fourth dimension is just another direction, another direction that you cannot turn into, but you can in this game because you have a superpower that allows you to do it, which is the rotate and control R, which is which aligns you somehow i don't know the basics of it but i don't know the like the basics i think so at least that's how i understood it oh yeah anyways i simply stood there and looked in all four directions like in all four axes and saw if anything's missing if there was a block that's around it's the exact same thing with going to mining in a fourth dimension you just have to mark your way, you just have to mark your way. If you don't have a compass, you know, which is, you know, if you lost your house and you have a compass, you just follow the coordinates. As simple as that, you rotate, and then you move in the fourth, in the fourth dimension, and then you set yourself at a specific, uh, at a specific W, you know, control R, and then you look for your house in that coordinate. Now my house is in the 137th W coordinate, so let's go back there. Now, remember what I said, how, hold on, it's the 137th, not the 136th. Uh, give me a second, give me a second, there we go. Now, remember how I said that You have to mark that what if you don't have a compass right what if you don't have coordinates to your house you just mark your way but hold on if I mark my way and switch and rotate to a different W the game will crash so yeah after the game crashes you go back to your point and you start your mining session and then hold on hazy i have a block here right but if i switch to a different position the block disappears how will i get back and i'm like well of course you silly you you silly silly man girl remember how this is the this is the fourth dimension yo and in the fourth dimension, you have a superpower, right? That allows you to look into the W coordinate. If you're not using that superpower, how can you find your way back? It's like you've looked here. We found some blocks on, uh, on our way. You just step on them, by the way, and just control R. And you'll go back to, the, to your uh, normal environment. Well, of course, like I said, by scrolling, by rotating. It's not that I move to a different dimension. No, by scrolling, I simply look into the W coordinate. That's what I do. The, this, this superpower is just looking, is just being able to look in the W axis. That's the superpower. If I'm not looking in the W direction, I cannot get lost in it as well. If I'm looking in a different W coordinate, I walk in 
you the direction I'm looking to double the coordinate and I'm not taking note of where I've been then I'll get lost and to find my way all I have to do is keep looking f until I find a, f a block that I recognize from my location from my known location so I go to that block and control R it's as simple as that you have to look so let's, for example, go to a mining session. Let's go. Uh, I'll say, for example, this place. Let's stand on this block. Oh, by the way, if you stand on, on one block, just like in Minecraft, if you stand on a block, say this block, and you look around, you're not doing anything in particular. You just look around. It's the same concept here. If you stand on a block, this block has four dimensions. It doesn't have, th it doesn't have uh, like, it has three dimensions, I'm sorry. It doesn't have the usual two dimensions that you're used to, like one by one block. No, it has a one by one by one block. So if you look anywhere in the W dimension, no matter where, no matter how much, that block won't change because you're standing on it and you're not moving from it. Same in Minecraft. Th these both games, they work on the same principle. So let's do Control R. Now, if I want to start a mining session and say I don't like this preset, <laughs> Like, I don't like how I see this, so let's look at a different direction. Let's see if we can find a bigger cave in a different direction. All right, we found a, we found a good enough cave in this direction. And you see, we still have our block that will, you know, remind us of our path. Now, say we're really deep in the mines. Right? We mine, let's get some iron. Yeah, let's go, got some iron. Now we want to go back to our uh, normal settings. Simple as that. We climb back, I think. Yeah. It's easy as that. Just put a block. Let's go back. And it's not there. Okay, I'm moving to a different place. Alright, let's look where we've been. Let's look for our uh, safety block. There he is. There it is. See? Found it. Found it. Let's go back to it. There we go. And that's how you, f and that's how you find your way back. Yeah. And that's how you find your way back. You just remember to, keep to that you're not looking in, that looking in all directions in this game is also including rotating and shifting between dimensions. For example, if you do shift Q, you also move in double dimensions. Just not a lot. You move like one coordinate, I think. Let's check. Yep, you move just one. So, another qu what the f oh okay, <laughs> that was weird. Any okay, you know what? Let's let's just uh, let's just find that way. Yeah, there we go. Okay. <clears throat> so another comment I got was, "Yo, you said you blocked it from all directions, even in 40, and this is that." The most 40 proof shed ever but if i do that the house is gone they can just attack me here and i'm like bro are you high no they cannot look there's no house here you want to know why there's no house here because this where i'm standing right now is not in the house see i'm not standing in the house where you were looking in the fourth dimension is an entirely different location. All right, I'll make it clear. See, this is a different location again. Hold on, let's just, there, there we go. I think that's the house. I think so. I think so. The best bet, yeah, it's blocked, yeah. Let's just, let's just take a step back, there we go. You just have to look. All right, so what do I mean by saying, yo, this is not the same location? What do you mean, Hazy? Are you fucking high? Yes, it is the same location. I just looked somewhere in the fourth dimension and it's gone. Look, it's the same XYZ coordinate too. Like, the spiders can attack me here. And I'm like, no, I'm saying to you, yes, they can attack you here because you're not in the house. <laughs> this, is a, this is a completely different location. 
this is not inside the house. Now let me explain that. What I mean by that is you're literally not inside the house. Let's take Minecraft for example. Let's take XYZ for example. Let's let's just let's say this game only has XYZ for now. Okay. Okay. So in X in X the YZ, I have an X an X coordinate and a Z coordinate, right? If I move only in the X coordinate. Am I in the same location? Is a zombie standing right there can attack me? Even if, even if he's far away? No, he cannot. He cannot attack me because we're different locations. I have a different X. Now, same goes for Z. If I have the same X as the zombie but a different Z, can he attack me? He cannot. It's the exact same thing in the doubly dimension. Entities cannot hit you where you're not Where you're not there if you're not there if I When I scroll you have to always remember that scrolling is essentially looking at a different location right now I'm not looking at the house. I'm not looking at where the house is supposed to be. I'm looking at a completely different location So again, just remember you have to remember the W, the fourth dimension, is just another direction that you cannot look into unless you have superpowers. Savvy? Alright. Well, I hope you learned something, and good luck.